Hi friends, Abhishek here. This is day two of our Euro trip, visiting St. Peter's Basilica, and then we will visit the Leaning Tower of Pisa. If you have missed day one, walking around Rome with me, please click on I button above. Now entering St. Peter's Basilica, the greatest of all churches of Christendom, come along with me. the church facing this side you can see how these columns have been designed it is like Saint Peter's is standing and embracing the people this is the concept it's I am the church and it is embracing like this so that is the reason this particular design has been made the Saint Peter's Church was not the only first church over here there was another church which they broke and they made a new church over here. The groundbreaking of this particular church happened in 1506, completed in 1626. In the olden times, completing a church, a cathedral in 100 and 150 years, it's like wow, so fast, because churches have taken 600 years, 700 years to get completed. So, getting these things done so fast is really a big achievement. It's the highest, as far as the Christianity goes, it is the top of Christianity. Named after one of the 12 apostles of Christ, St. Peter's.
these plants that you see on your left and right are normally nurseries. This particular place, Mr. is very famous for its nurseries and a lot of families are into this nursery business. So you can see various kinds of plants sold all over the place. All these are private owned lands. And then you have the leaning tower. Now that's a bell tower. All cathedrals have to have a bell tower. Whether it's inside the cathedral, whether it is next to a cathedral, or whether it's sometimes slightly away from a cathedral, but it has to be there. The reason why this is called the King of Miracle is the fact that it's kind of straight. The cathedral is kind of straight. Only the tower. Now, Yes, there is a miracle which nobody has been able to find out even till today. So that's a bell tower for the cathedral. The groundbreaking had started in 1173 and the construction completed in 1372. It was done by another very famous uh, architect by the name of Bonano Pisan. It has got nothing to do with Pisan that his name is relevant or something. But he was the person who was actually responsible for this tower. Now, when he started making the way, the total height is 55.86 meters from ground level. And it is made in totally white marble from Kanara. Now, Thanks for watching. If you have enjoyed, please like and subscribe. See you soon again.